हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई चैनल इंडियन टैलेंट हाउ आर यू ऑल आई होप एवरी वन आर गुड अवर टूडेज वीडियो इज माइंड ब्लोइंग फ्लावर फैक्ट्स सो वी नो दैट द फ्लावर्स अट्रैक्ट अस विद इट्स ब्यूटी विजुअली एंड विद इट्स स्मेल इमोशनली फ्लावर्स आर द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट ब्यूटिफुल पार्ट ग्रोन ऑन ए प्लांट और ट्री फ्लावर्स आर ऑल्सो यूज फॉर ग्रीटिंग अदर्स सो वाई डू स्मेल कम्स फ्रॉम दी फ्लावर्स The scientific reason is that the flowers release smell to attract insects and birds that will fertilize the flowers. The insects, birds and butterflies pollinate the pollen grains from one flower to the another flower. So do you know what was the first flower on the earth? Researchers have found that Arche fructus is the first flower on the earth. Arche fructus is an extinct aquatic plant's flower. which was 125 million years ago or 135 million years ago grown on earth its fossil material is found from the yixian lake in liaoning province of north east china it was found in 1998 anthurium bloomific is considered the strongest plant on the earth watermill is the smallest flower on the earth it grows in every lakes rafflesia arnoldi is the world's largest flower It is a parasitic plant with no leaves and no stem. Lotus is the national flower of India. Lotus is used for creating many Asian herbal medicines. Lotus symbolizes the beauty, purity and knowledge of India. Lotus is also known as water lily. Lotus has higher cultural values in both India and as well as in China and Japan. Placing jabara daisies beside you can help you get a good sleep because this flower releases oxygen and absorbs carbon monoxide it was found useful for the people who had insomnia these flowers are local flowers of south africa these flowers lives up to 2 to 3 years they bloom during spring and summer these flowers require heavy sunlight and moist soil many species of jerbera daisies are cultivated in india like in west bengal maharashtra andhra and many more states So now let's know some amazing facts about roses. Rose is the national flower of United States of America. Roses are edible, they are not harmful. Roses are used in perfumes. Rose plants also have a important part called rose hips. These fruits of rose contain vitamin C which the company uses to make many products like jellies, jams and creams. Roses are related to apples, cherries, almonds and plums. Natural black roses are grown only at one place called Alfeti in Turkey. These type of glass domes are created to save roses up to 20 years alive. Tulip bulbs were used as food source. These tulip bulbs were not tasty but due to hunger and food shortage during the World War II Tulip bulbs were claimed to be eaten. I request you please do not eat anything after seeing this video. This video is just for knowledge. Do you know broccoli is a vegetable and also a flower? Broccoli is mostly grown in California, Arizona, Texas and Oregon. Broccoli also is grown on large scale in Italy, Northern Europe and Far East. It have many nutritional values and it is made in many recipes. So we were eating in flower. So have you ever tried broccoli? Tell me in the comment section. Hydrangeas these are also the most beautiful flowers. These are over 75 species of flowering plants native to Asia and the Americas and also found in China, Korea and Japan. The speciality of this flowers hydrangeas is that the soil determines its flower color. Hydrangea's color it is is determined by the acidity of the soil means if the soil is too alkaline the result of the flowers will be pink Hydrangea's require plenty of space to grow and spread because they can grow up to 10 feet wide and reach up to 15 feet tall Today every girl like to wear a flower crown on her head do you know from where this trend came from Queen Victoria was the former queen of the United Kingdom. Queen Victoria was the flower trend setter. During the Queen Victoria era 1837 to 1901, in order to be considered a well-modern lady, 
you are expected to learn how to maintain flowers queen victoria loved flowers so much that instead of wearing her crown she preferred to wear her orange colored floral wreath and she thought of making wedding flowers a must for all brides so now let's know some interesting facts about sunflowers each sunflower can contain as many as 1000 or 2000 seeds sunflowers are local flowers of north america there are about 70 species of sunflowers world's tallest sunflower is 30 feet tall which is recorded in guinness book of world record sunflower is grown as a crop for edible oil and seeds the sunflower is also used as a feed for wild bird and for the cows and buffaloes sunflowers saved lives surprisingly sunflowers were used to fill life jackets these raft were used to clean water from the chernobyl disaster chernobyl disaster was a nuclear accident that occurred on in 1986 because of certain mistakes sunflowers removed the cesium and strontium radioactive elements from the soil and ponds surrounding the disaster site successfully sunflowers made the both soil and the water pure 95% daffodils are used as currency by sir prince charles daffodils are native to northern europe and always it grows in everywhere in the world Do you know some flowers which really smell like a real chocolate? These beautiful dark burgundy flowers smell like a chocolate exactly. Wow, so amazing. Black salsify, chocolate mint, chocolate daisy. All these flowers really exactly smell like a chocolate. Have you seen them ever? And the most important thing I want to tell you today is the language of flowers called as floreography they used to communicate in the form of the names of the flowers floreography was invented by two people mary watchley and orby de la motrae they both introduced floreography into england and sweden before the 18th century it was not so popular but in the 18th century after the origination of this book it became famous it was originated in france and the first popular book was in 1819 le de language by charolte de la tour and the floreography became most popular during the victorian era 1837 to 1901 it was the time when the flowers was used to convey messages in persia and the middle east The publication of the flower dictionaries explaining the meaning of plants, flowers and herbs that tradition became to spread in England. Soon it became very popular to use flowers to send secret messages. The flowers were used to, to explain a positive message and sometimes it was used to give a negative message. It was depending on the situation and the style how it was used. Nowadays a new book is published Floreography an illustrated guide to the Victorian language of flowers by Jessica Rocks and floreography is still used in Europe by many people Thank you for watching like subscribe and share See you in the next video